What's up everybody, Sebastian here, and this video, what I would like to be talking about here is how nature, this universe, or life wants balance, right? So let's give an example right here, okay? Let's say you put a one kilo object on the right side and a one kilo object on the left side, okay? What happens when you do that, okay? It will stay balanced, okay? You will be like, as you thought, wow, this is balanced, okay? Now, what happens if you put a one kilo on the one side and a two kilo on the other side? Whoops! It will be unbalanced, okay? Then you're gonna be in a mind, oh, in order for, to get the one kilo balances the two kilo, I must add more weight. I must add another one kilo on it. Boom, then two kilo, two kilo is equal, okay? Now, let's take an example. You add two kilo on the one side and one kilo on the other side, and you you add 500 more grams to the 1 kilo side. Whoops. It will be a bit more... You see, it will be almost balanced, but not exactly, okay? Now, why do I explain this here? It's because, like... I would like you to get an example of, like, what I will... be talk about... in this video. You understand? I wanted you to understand the concept, okay? Now, let's say, for example, right now... In life, okay, just how, you know, with the balance, okay, in life, nature, creatures, we want everything to be balanced, okay? Um, you can take some examples now in nature, okay? What happens if you see a big thing of water, like this here? Like, there's a big, huge pond. And right here, there's a whole bunch of water and there's a big wall. Okay? If you let go of this wall, water will flood. Why? Because the amount of water that was on this side was way too much. So then, nature, since the wall got away, nature wanted it balanced all over the place. At the same height, you understand? Right. So, what I want to try to say here is like, how, you see, nature in life, okay? How is, how does nature want us, okay? Um, for example, let's say, for example, you, you are like isolated in your house, like for months. You're like, oh fuck. I'm getting really tired of this here. I hate it. I wish I could go and see my friends, but I can't, you know, I'm really scared of what others will think of me. I can't go and approach that side. I can't go and talk to this girl. I can't go traveling. I'm all depressed and stuff, you know? When that happens here, it's like... That's also a, a hint. Life wants... Right? Life, Mother Nature. The universe wants balance for you in your life. So, it's like, at one time, like, since you're like, okay, you get really unbalanced here. It's like, nature's putting it down, like, oh, I'm at home and stuff. I'm so afraid to go out. Um, I'm so afraid to go and talk to this girl. I'm so afraid to meet new friends. I'm so afraid to go traveling, blah, blah, blah. It's like, right there, it's like, what happened to your life is like, it's getting unbalanced, okay? Okay? And it's like, how can you get it balanced again? And right there, it's like, life will present you opportunities, giving you hints to change something, okay? Because it's unbalanced. So, life might, at one time, you'll be, okay, actually, I will choose a decision. I will decide to go and approach this girl and talk to three new strangers. What happened then when you do it? Brook! 
You get more balanced. Uh, what would that happen? Oh, whoa, I feel amazing now. You know what? I'm gonna go traveling now. Because life is giving you a head that's unbalanced, so it wants you to be balanced now. Whoops! You are going to be balanced again, you understand? Listen to this quote here. Depression is your avatar telling you it's tired of the person you're trying to play. It's tired of the character you're trying to play, all right? Depression is the avatar telling you it's tired of being the character you are trying to play, all right? So, in which way, it's so important to take the hints life is giving to you, all right? It's like, for example, this, uh, at one time, like, for example, let's say this guy is single, okay? So single, single, single. He struggles to approach girls. He struggles to put himself out there. He struggles to to put himself in new situations, new social situations, okay? And he's like, oh, I really want a girlfriend. I really want a girlfriend. I really want a girlfriend. Fuck, I always get rejected and stuff, blah, 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 blah. And the reason for that is because, you see, life is, is on balance here. So, for him, what happens then? Oh, oh, okay, I'm gonna go try now. I get rejected. I get rejected again. I get rejected again. I get rejected again. I get rejected again. Oh, a date. See? It's almost bad and see. He's like, whoa, holy fuck, man. This is epic. Date doesn't go well. Let's try again. Boom, got a girlfriend. Balanced again. Nature wants us balanced, okay? <laughs> now, there's so much examples, okay? For example, there are also examples in relationships. For example, let's say, for example, you and your partner, you know, you're doing really well, you know, but at one time everything goes to shit and you realize that, okay, something is getting unbalanced here with my partner and no matter how much I try to fix the situation with my partner, I just wasn't able to keep it balanced, okay? In fact, it got even more unbalanced. Then right here, there's a hint, life is growing you. Break up with her. Whoops! Balance again. Alright? So, like... <laughs> I hope this helps you in a way, like... Like, stop... Um... Appreciating the hint life is giving to you. Alright, take that fucking hint. If you're bored every single fucking day in a job you hate, take the hit life is giving you to quit that job. Take that hit. If you're tired of being at home all day fucking day, take that hit life is giving to you and jump at the opportunity. Gosh. I'm like, man, it's like, are people that stupid? You need to realize the fucking head life is growing at you. It's like, do something about it. Like, oh, I'm tired of always playing video games. I want to get back inside of my body. I want to go and approach people. Go and fucking do it then. And stop complaining. What's the alternative? What is it? Continue staying in a house? That doesn't seem like a good alternative to me. It would just make you unbalanced, you know? So it's like, <laughs> I know, I mean, I hope this helped you out, okay? Go out, explore, live the best life you can. Alright? Because one day, we're gonna be dead, eaten up by fucking worms. Okay? So, I hope this woke you up, okay? To stop living life and stop acting on the hints life is giving you and make it balanced. And it's like also like, for example, like, it's like, 
you you had sensed it, okay? You had sensed that something's gone bad, and it's like I can go fast back to, into my past. Why did I switch to online school? Why did I switch to online school? Because I was on balance. I felt okay. This school isn't for me. I've grudged on people. People were bullying me. They're really mean to me. What's the alternative? Stay in that school? I'd probably still be unbalanced. Oh, another option. Hmm. Maybe go to switch to online school. I want to distance myself from humans and I want to work on my own schedule and travel the world whenever I want. Whoops! Got balanced. All right. What happened then? For example, like. Okay, then I realize, oh, I'm starting to not be with a lot of my friends. Started being in my house a lot. So there I got like a bit balanced. Hmm. Go and do this au pair thing. I want to travel. Whoops! Balanced again. Oh, I didn't see my friends for a while. Okay, let's go and see them. Whoops! Back to nobody again. Oh, I didn't walk out for a while. Let's work out. Boom! Balanced! Okay? Those hints that life is giving to you. Oh, I, I should do this. I should do that. Why am I not doing it? Take fucking action! Alright? Bro. Now, evidently, I can go for hours talk about this topic, but this is enough information for now. Feel free to drop a like, comment, subscribe, share with your friends if you enjoyed. I hope this video helped you out. And peace out.